but as boot makers, what we wanted to do is uh, really focus on some of the finish work and the fine finish work of the boot. And oh. if you'll notice on the inside of this product, we've, we've used what we call hung leather linings. That's a pig lining. Oh yeah. But it's a one piece lining. You don't see any of the stitching or any of the embroidery work. <coughs> Part showing through, yeah. Coming through. Right, right. Again, just the finish work on the product. Um, and a lot of a lot of other products, you can see the stitching. It's just uh, that we just felt like as boot makers, we wanted to finish this boot off like we did 40, 50 years ago. Interesting. The inseams that are often left naked finished, mm -hmm. we have rolled and then we put a satin covering tape on it so it's smooth mm -hmm. against your skin. So if that's rubbed against your skin, it doesn't irritate you. Yeah, you see, you see how that uh, that's taped. Uh huh. You got Jonathan. And then we finish all of our pulls as well. Now, that would be on our Western product. We finish like that on our work product and our casual product. Uh, oftentimes, uh, uh, other people will leave a naked finish or raw finish. Mm -hmm. But we wanted to finish this boot off. So on those products, we put an air mesh lining. Again, it gives a little breathability, but a really nice hand. But then we also roll and we also tape the inseams of this as well. Okay. We finish it off by tacking down all of our pulls. We don't leave our pulls unfinished. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay, so we just try okay. to finish off this boot. We collar everything and just try to make it real clean. That is clean, yeah. So there's leather underneath yeah. this netting here. Yep. Okay. You gotcha. Yeah. So we just try to finish it off and make it real clean. And, and also adds a little body to it. If you've often mm -hmm. seen work right. boots, sometimes it's just floppy on top. Yeah. yeah. It gives a little bit more body.